So what started as a curiosity in Georgia is turning into a landmark in Luthersville. Caitlin Ross shows you how an entire community is now cheering on one woman's green thumb. That's yellow day lilies. Walking through Jackie Flournoy's garden. Mm -hmm. It's real pretty. Is a lesson in history. My daddy always called it a blooming pear bush. And in humor. The knock you out roses. Knock you out? Uh-huh. The knowledge blooms freely here. I just put it out and let it go. The wonder. Yep, it'll be a surprise. Is in the waiting. Well, I guess it's like waiting for Christmas. <laughs> you just have to sit back and wait and see what you get. <laughs> and she's been waiting a long time for this. Ooh, a lot. A lot of things have changed over the years. Mm-hmm. Since 1987, to be exact. Mr. Gorbachev, tear down this wall. Ronald Reagan was president. Nintendo was king. Eggs cost 97 cents. It's unusual. And Jackie Flournoy was planting seeds for the future. Lord, I have no idea. This is a plant that's taken 36 years to grow. I always thought nobody else has this but me. <laughs> More than a quarter century to realize its true potential. I mean, I've never seen anything like it. For 36 years, the cactus just sat in Jackie's front yard. But when she looked out her window in May, just all of a sudden it just shot up 25 feet in the air. It's so tall. It's like you got to crane your head back to look. Yep, you got to lean your head back. The stalk stands tall over Luthersville, Georgia. And everybody says, well, that's a landmark, you know. The whole city now watching. There was a lady out there with the camera. And waiting for the flower. I love the beauty of it, it being unique, different. It's just a mystery all around. The agave americana, or century plant. Don't get stuck. Only blooms once in its lifespan. Nature is a mystery between 25 and 45 years after it's planted. It is rare. More like a desert plant. And safeguarded in the places it typically blooms. They say Mexico, Southern California, South America, but they never mention Georgia. <laughs> the buds will eventually give way to bold yellow blossoms. It looks like at the top it's gonna have a huge bloom. Now that the stalks they, shot up, they're amazed at it. She's on standby. It's at a slow point right now. I, I'm just waiting, waiting. She knows the wonder is in the waiting now. I've enjoyed it all these years. Because everyone blooms in their own time. I guess it's like part of the family or whatever. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I absolutely love that story. I'm waiting for the giant to come down the stalk. Y'all know the story. It could be days or a few weeks before those flowers bloom, but we will be sure to share pictures as soon as it happens. And once those flowers bloom, the entire plant will die and make way for more century plants in its place.